Hi guys, so today we are sadly leaving Glasgow, so we are just going back home and well, we're going to go through World G3 so it's not all over, it's not going to be all boring. Bye bye Premier Inn, see you later. So we are all just out for lunch at Donazio's and look what all we've got. Kate and Mum have a sharing platter and some chips in the middle for all to share and I've got a huge pizza, not surprised. Do you know how much I love Urban Decay? I really want the naked cherry palette that's here. I think I wore the wrong top today because I am roasting. Um, well, I only got like two things. I thought that's all I really needed. I got the Urban Decay Naked Cherry Palette, which I have wanted for quite a while. It looks so gorgeous, doesn't it? Um, tell me if I should put that palette in a tasting video or what. And then I've got the... Well, I've put that in the wrong way. <laughs> and then I bought the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Highlighter in shade Oh Darling. I was planning to get this in like the Shine Pretty Things packaging. You know how they have like two highlighters in their collection? I planned to get it in that kind of packaging but they didn't have that in stock and they suggested I have it in the original packaging and I th then I thought, why not? It looks gorgeous anyway. I have not found Rose yet. He's probably outside being a pig. I thought I'd open two things from my advent calendar because I missed out the first one and today's the 2nd of December so I'm opening two things. I wonder how this works. My friend bought me this by the way and I told you I could keep it until December so... Oh, I want to say this. No, let's see. Do you have to like, yeah, wonder what's in here. Um, looks like, what's this? It is a, what's that say? Amazing lipstick. I've never seen it before, but looks good to me. And now we need to open number two. Like so. Looks like an even bigger one. Um, let's see what this is. Um, it looks like a wee brush. But yeah, that's a good start to it. I like this. Oh, you know, I really want the Christmas tree one. You know, the big huge one that's like £50. Oh, that looks so good. Uh, so, I know I haven't filmed much today because there hasn't been really all that much to film. But anyway, uh, I am just so tired. But... I want to get this makeup off so badly because I've had it on for hours and hours and hours and the, the thought, you know the thought of just taking your makeup off and then it feels like an absolute chore but then it's done in instantly half a minute, I don't know, but something like that and then you're so relieved, you know that feeling. But also I just want to go through a quick run through of what I used today if any of you are interested. So I used the NYX Born to Glow Primer, which I bought yesterday and it's really good. I highly recommend it. Uh, what else did I use? I used, I used the same foundation as yesterday. Same concealer. Uh, same powder. Same eyebrow stuff, the Anastasia stuff. And then I also used the Sofix Palette Extra Spice. 
I kind of switched it up today because instead of using Infinity on my lids, I used the shades LA Sun and Dreams. As you can see right here. And then I used the same mascara as yesterday, the, you know, the NARS Climax one. And for our contour today, I used the Too Faced Cocoa Contour in the shade Medium Cocoa on my cheeks and my nose to do a bit of nose contouring, like put a bit of shape in there. And then same blush and same highlight. Look at that though. Like at first it seems pretty sheer, but then throughout the day it just seems to be getting better. And then for my lips, I used the same lip liner, same setting spray. And today I used the MAC and Jamie Genevieve collaboration lipstick, which I absolutely love. <sighs> I don't know what I'd do without it, honestly. But for now, I'm just going to take my makeup off, get uh, into bed, because I am pretty tired. Just wondering, does anybody else, whenever they are about to go on a plane, does anyone else all the time have a tiny little fear of the plane crashing? And then once once the plane's actually landed, you're like, what was all the fuss about? But that brings us to the end of Vlogmas Day 2. And I hope you enjoyed it and stay tuned for Day 3. Three.